हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू क्रिएटिव मेडिसिन इन दिस लेक्चर वी विल लर्न अबाउट द इंडिकेशन ऑफ नेजल इंट्यूबेशन आर फॉर ओरल सर्जरी if there is inadequate mouth opening and for prolonged intubation nasal intubation is done maximum time for endotracheal intubation is 2 weeks you can only do endotracheal intubation for 2 weeks only nasal intubation indications of nasal intubation are in case of oral surgery because the surgery is going through the mouth it is difficult to do nasal intubation whereas in any inadequate uh, sorry in oral surgeries it is difficult to go through endotracheal intubation because endotracheal tube is put through the mouth so instead of going through endotracheal intubation it is better to do nasal intubation in oral surgery whereas in prolonged intubation it is better to do through nasal intubation only and if there is inadequate mouth opening because there is inadequate mouth opening it is a difficult airway so it is very difficult to put an endotracheal tube inside so in such cases we put a nasal intubation uh, inside the Uh, person and we do nasal intubation in such procedures so nasal intubation is done in oral surgery is inadequate mouth opening and prolonged intubation thank you and thank you for watching